When you have a kid, you realize that women are the toughest creatures on earth. Tougher than men, hands down. You guys are tougher than men. You guys have babies, you know what I mean? You can't beat that. And see, there's men in here who are like, oh, what are you talking about? You ain't tougher than me. I used to play football. That's tough, football. You think you're tough because you catch a football? That's tough. That ain't tough. Let a football come out of your ass. That's tough. <laughs> Sit in the delivery room. <laughs> Having a baby? Are you serious? No one can top a baby? Are you serious? I went in tough. You know what I mean? I went in. I had a hat that said coach. I went in tough. I was like, oh, yeah, push, push. I said stuff like, we can do it. I ain't doing crap. Push, push. And then this head starts to pop out. I don't care how tough you are. Once that head pops out, you turn into the biggest bitch in the delivery room. Push, push. Okay, here he comes. Here he comes. Okay, push. Oh my god. Uh, oh, push! Oh my god, push! She's gonna die. Oh! Oh! Push! Eight pounds, six ounces. Eight pounds, six ounces. And here's the thing about guys. You see your baby coming, eight pounds, six ounces. You see how big it gets. We don't go, oh, here comes my son or here comes my daughter. We don't think like that. We see how big it gets. We're like, man, she lied. <laughs> right? You know how many times she stopped me in the middle and said, oh, my God, you're hurting me. Shut What? <laughs> what are you talking about? There's no move I can do. To top eight pounds, six ounces, there's no, what? I can start from the back of the room. Ah! I'm gonna, eight pounds, six ounces? You can't top eight pounds, six ounces. There's nothing a guy can do to top eight pounds, six ounces. She won, there's nothing. Eight pounds, six, this is what it looked like right here. Eight pounds, six ounces. What am I gonna do with that? Me inside that is like a, like a flashlight in a cave. It's so fun, though, when you have a kid, like a little boy, man. I mean, the crazy thing about having a son or just having a kid is they can do, they can cry for anything. You know, you know what I mean? They'll cry for anything. Like, it should be the smallest thing, and they'll cry like someone just died in the family. You know, they don't care, and they'll do it anywhere. At the mall, they don't care. They don't care that people are looking at you, and you're being a good dad because you don't want to give them a cookie because he hasn't had lunch yet. He'll cry, he doesn't care. Daddy, can I have a cookie? No, you haven't had lunch yet. <laughs> I want a daddy! I want a cookie, daddy! <laughs> and then he'll pause, and you think he's done crying, but he's not. He's just building up more air to throw this bigger yell at you, like, ah! are walking by like, get him a cookie. <laughs> Bad enough, he's wearing a helmet. <laughs> That's something we should never grow out of. You know what I mean? Like, he got the cookie. He won. You know what I mean? We should always cry for stuff we want. <laughs> you know what I mean? If you're in bed and you want sex <laughs> and she won't give it to you, like, can we do it tonight? Uh, not tonight. I'm, I'm kind of tired. <laughs> Neighbors are gonna be like, just have sex with them. <laughs>